Hi everyone. In this video, we are just going to see about the mix functions. What is called a mix function? Mix functions are nothing but a MATLAB executable functions. Okay, MATLAB executable functions. M for MATLAB and EX for executables. Okay, why we need these MATLAB executable functions in a MATLAB environment? Okay, or in a Simulink environment. So first, I'll just give you a overview of a mix functions. Okay. So if you Google it, you, uh, it will give lot of uh, questions and answers, right? So first we'll see about what is a MATLAB mix file. A mix file is a function created in MATLAB that calls a C or C++ program or a script. C or C program or C++ script or a photon subroutine. Okay. So a mix function behaves just like a MATLAB script or function. Okay. So it works like a MATLAB script. MATLAB script in sense m script or function so to call a mix function use the name of the mix file say for example we have a the mix file name rte canambam okay so we have to call those uh, um, call the name of that mix file without the file extension okay so we have to call it without the file extension the mix file contains only one function or subroutine so it has only one function or only one subroutine okay so Coming here, we can see uh, how to compile MX files in a MATLAB. Okay, so it provides library functions for a number of important operations or maybe some additional tasks by writing M files from the scratch. Okay, but there are certain tasks that cannot be accomplished efficiently using the resources in MATLAB itself. Okay, so to out um, to address such cases, MATLAB provides an interface to allow code written in other languages say for example a c or c++ code is there okay say for example a c or c++ code okay you have to execute this program in a matlab environment so you have to execute this program in matlab environment okay in a matlab environment so how we are going to execute this program in a matlab environment you need a compiler you need a compiler so without compiler you can't execute any c or c plus plus script right so here we have to go for a mix compiler matlab executable compiler okay to compile c or c++ program say for example your uh, function calls a c program and you had, uh, in order to work with the matlab environment it should be executable by calling the function mix function okay so how you are uh, just to do it, it is like say the application wise here they said on example image processing toolbox okay in that uh, some mix functions are there you have to call that mix function of open bracket and close bracket once if they call this function this uh, checks the arguments passed to it and allocate space for an answer okay so these functions are defined in the header file itself so first we need to define the header file max.h library file included at the top of the file okay so before you can use the new uh, function you have to compile it using the matlab command max we have to compile it the first step is to configure max so it knows what compiler to use it knows uh, right okay so you can do this by typing max space setup mix space setup at the command prompt it will search for all the compilers on your system okay it will search for all the compilers on the system so matlabs comes with a compiler called lcc which you can um, use if you don't have any others installed okay however it's a very efficient compiler and so you have either gcc or the microsoft visual c++ compiler so normally uh, i would use in my environment is microsoft sdk 7.1 okay or else i can use uh, c++ compiler in some environment is like min gwc compiler okay so in the command window you have to type mix space setup so please choose your compiler it will ask us to choose a compiler uh, would you like to mix to locate installed compilers it's um, asking us to locate so these are all the compilers ins installed in that system okay so finally we have to select 
uh, the number 3 compiler 3 here i have selected microsoft visual c++ c or c++ version 7 okay so that is the path here so i have selected the compiler here so what is the next step it will compile the c++, c++ program into a another file format okay which which matlab understandable file format so that is the function of this c mix space that path with the cpp file c++ file okay and uh, here are some uh, tasks they assigned it so this is how the mix files works okay hope you gain some uh, knowledge on converting a, a c or c++ file to a matlab executable format okay sure thanks for watching